What is everybody's boy saying one thumb? You know what I'm saying? Man, all right. Mariko, this is not a request from you, but uh, you was talking about that one video where you, you had no clue what was going on with their feet. Well, this right here, what I'm about to show you, and those of you who just now wandered into my channel to watch for the first time ever seen this ugly mug, don't forget to smash that subscribe button, smash that like button, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm doing this stuff all the time from music reactions, dance reactions, tap dance, ballet, whatever, all music genre, you know, uh, genres from foreign to domestic, rap, rock, country, whatever you can think of and whatever you send my way is what I'm getting. So thank you all for joining me. I know that was, that was good, wasn't it? I won't ever be able to do that again. <laughs> but Mariko, okay, so this is Memphis Jukin. Now, you want to talk about some footwork. You want to talk about some serious footwork. Jukin is where it's at. It's just their own style. They've created and mastered and turned into something just absolutely amazing and beautiful to watch. I mean, with the gangster twist, of course, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, oh, yeah, and... This is G Nerd versus Dre M. And this is Jukin Wars, I do believe is what it was called. Jukin Wars came out a few months back. Yeah, G Nerd versus Dre M. Uh, Jukin Wars Gnome. You know what I'm saying? So I, I this came across, and I think I may have even had a request for this. I know I've had some Dre M uh, requests that I haven't got to. And so hopefully this makes up for some of it. Uh, so brace yourselves. I haven't seen this yet. So we're gonna get it. Graham is straight fire. Ooh, okay, that's clean. Although that person holding the camera needs to wash the feet though. Ooh. I'm trying to save the Oh okay that was clean. That was perfectly timed, well timed, with that doo, doo, with his feet. It's amazing, you know, dancing with just your feet. I mean, of course, they're doing the arms and stuff a little bit too, but when it's majority feet, when it's ninety percent feet, that's hard to do and hard to master. That I, that's why I really love this style and I really appreciate it. I love to watch it because it's not easy work. I mean, like I was talking about tap dancing, that's a lot of work. Oh, let's see that again, though. That slide right there was clean. But I'm saving it, though, because I know Dreams will come out. Woo! That was good with that good, clean finish on it. Woo! Woo! There we go. So when you're good like that, it literally looks like you're sliding on ice. I mean, when you were that good, if you, if you make it look like them shoes that got grip are sliding on ice, that's good. Ooh, it's, it's a long round too. That's why it's eight minutes. Oh, good clean arm work. Good wave. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. All right. Now, I don't know if Dre is next. I, I, it's been a minute since I've seen him. He's probably grown since last time I reacted to him. So I, I, it's hard to tell. It's kind of dark. You know what I mean? Like the, the lighting and everything is hard, hard to tell if that's him or not. And I don't know if, you know, if he grew his hair out or whatever. But uh, clean footwork. You very, very great use and utilization of the song. You know what I mean? Well timed out. 
I mean, it's, it's it really pays off to study the song and study what you're where you're going to be dancing to, because to do an outright freestyle battle and you don't know the song, you know what I mean. You're just kind of left to the basic beat of the song. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's let's keep on moving. Oh, okay, here we go. Ezra M. Okay, it's been a minute since I've seen him, so he grew his hair out a little bit. Now, you tell us some footwork. This is like straight footwork. I'm liking them pants, you know what I'm saying? It really brings focus to his feet, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, that's clean body weight. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I like that transition though from his toe, one foot, and then to his heel, it's on one foot. <laughs> ah! Ah! Woo! Clean come up. I feel like he needs more space, I, you know what I mean? Come on, he ain't done yet. Come on, he went on for a minute. No way. All right, hold on. Okay, so that's okay. So that's got to be obviously Dre and moved on, I guess, because this is probably who he's facing next. I'm guessing, but all right. So other dude went on for a minute. I don't, I, I don't know if that's G nerd or what. I don't know. I, I probably should have read the bottom. I didn't in the beginning. <laughs> Clean footwork from both of them, though. Clean movements, good body work too. Good, you know, waves, body waves. Them pants, I'm liking them pants he was wearing because again, it brings out focus to his feet. You know what I mean? It goes from the dark to the light to bring that extra focus down to to his feet because that's what I mean. He's proficient, like 100%, amazing with his footwork. Just from what I've seen, I haven't watched all all of his videos. Uh, but from the few I have seen, man, straight up top notch. Let's get it. Okay, so you moved on to the whole, whole other dude. Woo! <laughs> so the, the, he changed to... Uh, fit the song the same shoes I didn't look at him close enough you know, I was looking at his feet <laughs> Woo! okay that's clean and smooth wow I mean, you gotta come correct you're facing Dre M you know what I mean and he's, he's bringing it Woo! Oh, some tutting. Okay. Oh, into the footwork. Ooh. I don't know. That's tough. That is the bass is out outrageous though. You know, again recording. Spin. Oh, 
<laughs> That's a tough round. He, man. It's a tough round. This is a tough round. That's good. All right, he said, can't bust it out yet. Can't bust it out yet. You got to save it. We'll keep rolling. We'll keep rolling. Now, that's a tough round. That was clean. That was clean. 100% clean. I know I'm kind of low. Am I kind of low? Touching the ground. Oh, that's a tough one though. Dave's coming at him though. He's coming at him. He's got a lot of good body wave. He's, he's really working the, the, the popper lock with it. Simple moves. I'm going to say this. Hold on. I'll rewind it. Don't worry. This is how I always say it. Small, simple moves are sometimes the biggest moves. He ain't doing a whole lot right there, but he is. As you can tell, he's he's doing his, his heel toe, heel toe, heel toe like that, but he's going with the beat. Do, 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 like that. You know what I mean? It's those little, small, fine-tuned moves that really stand out and I really watch for. Like, I watch people's fingers when they're dancing to see if they incorporate their fingers to a finger wave, you know what I mean? Or something like that, because a lot of people don't, don't notice these little fine twicks and tweaks and so on, or even a face, like, doing stuff with your face, whatever. If you just move your ears, I'd probably watch it. But anyways, so it's those fine, simple moves that really stand out and can really make you stick out. Get what I'm saying? If but you know, if people are noticing and actually looking closer than just the full body or even just the feet. Get back. How he's able to get on his sides like that of his feet. See? It's clean. Woo! <laughs> What? What? I don't know though. It's still tough though. I mean, he's coming at him. He's coming correct, but man. <laughs> I hope it says who wins. Is this tough? <laughs> it's that slow mo. I don't think it said who won. That's it. That's it. That's it. Man, I don't know. I don't know. Both amazing. Man, I don't know. That was close. I mean, Dram's got you know got the crowd. I mean, even me. I mean, I'm, I'm not trying to be biased. You know, I'm not trying to pick sides, but I've seen Dre M dance. I know what he could do, and I know his skill, and he was amazing the whole time. G-Nerd was amazing, too. Absolute great, fluent footwork, technical work, tutting, body waves. I mean, using it all. Dre M, insane, though. 
what he does with his feet, the sides and how he walks and how he did that spin on the side of his foot. <laughs> you know, I'm going to say this right now, though, Dreyam, if you happen to see this video right here somehow, okay? I'm just I'm, I'm, I'm going to say it right now. You ain't got so many miles on them ankles. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got so many miles on them knees. So keep doing you. Keep being great. The same thing with G-Nerd. Same thing. Keep doing you. Keep being great. Uh, but doing those moves where you're on the side of your feet like that, do it while you can. Win them competitions. Get out there. Get it. You know what I'm saying? Because over time, wear and tear. Hey, maybe not. You know what I mean? Amazing, though. And you'd make it look painfully good. <laughs> Gene too, man, he's smooth, fluent. I like that, that slide. You know what I mean? Again, when when you are great at juke and, and you practice this every single day, you can make you, it look like you're sliding on ice on concrete. You can be outside in a parking lot and you can see him doing it and it literally looks like they're just sliding on ice. Like, it's just smooth like a bowling alley, you know what I mean? Just smooth, oiled up, but it's not. It's crazy. Absolute skill, absolute talents. Uh, tough, tough competition. I can't choose. I can't pick. They were both great. So you guys choose in the comments down below, you know what I'm saying? Leave a comment. Leave a comment on what you think. Who do you think might have got it? I mean, unless you were at that competition and you know it, I guess tell me. But who do you think, if you don't know, who you think might have got it? Because they're close. They were both great. Ugh, you know what I'm saying? All right, you guys, man, I appreciate y'all for watching, man. Mariko, I told you I'll show you some uh, crazy footwork. This is it right here. I mean, juking is a style that, when I first found out, it was called bucking. But uh, when I first seen it, I was blown away. Blown away. Again, I always did footwork myself, but nothing compared to that, to any juking or bucking I've seen. And I, of course, I started practicing. I was like, I gotta get some of that down. You know what I mean? Because that is just clean. I'm not good at it like I used to be. I used to practice it all the time. I mean, I had shoes that I danced in all the time and I would do it on concrete. I'd do it on any floor or whatever. And these shoes were Adidas, uh, just normal. Well, they were shell top style, but they were called Campus. They had a, a leather toe. Anyways, uh, and I danced in them so much that literally you could see my big toe and my next two toes. And only bald spots on the bottom of the shoe were full big toe tip of this toe and a tip of this toe you couldn't see my baby toe or whatever so uh and then you then, then my heel so you could see where i was constantly putting that pressure sliding and moving you know what i mean with my feet it looked crazy to see the bottom of the shoe and only have those bald spots where where my toes were and where my heel was <laughs> from constant sh sh practicing 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 i wore them out i wore those shoes forever you know what i mean all right, you guys, man, I appreciate y'all for watching, though, for real. Thank you all. And if you enjoyed what you've seen, don't forget to, to subscribe, like, comment, share, whatever it is. Just get it, you know what I'm saying? All right, you guys, till my next one.